Hey guys, it's Lucas. Today is going to be a fun day. I'm going to be potting up my tomatoes into larger containers. I like to reuse my 32 ounce yogurt containers for my tomatoes and my peppers and some of my plants that I start indoors under grow lights and I transplant them out into something larger. Here is my tray of tomatoes. I have roughly 50 plants in here and we can have six different varieties. My process is I start them out. This year I started them out in these compostable cells right here. I like these because it makes it really easy to transplant them into a larger container. I don't know if I'm going to want to continue to spend the extra money on these cells next year but I had some left over from last year. I want to use them up this year. Next year, I might just buy some plastic cell trays and do it that way and pop them out. But I do like these because they make them super easy to transfer. What I'm doing, just filling these yogurt cups halfway with some any kind of potting mix. Like I got this cheapo stuff called Stug Green. A green whatever it is and I filled all my containers halfway with that then I'm gonna transfer the cells into these and then I'm gonna cover them with the good stuff the happy frog this is what I started all my seedlings with already all right time to start transplanting all right so you just put the cell on top of the half full the green and then I'm just going to fill in around it with the good stuff the happy frog and there you have it guys it's going to write with a uh, sharpie right on the side of these yogurt containers the variety of tomato and then I only have 49 to go all right so that's it 48 plants later I have them all potted out and either these yogurt containers or these guys right here. A little more flimsy, but a little bigger. But they both do the trick really well. And I'm going to be keeping the majority of them out in my greenhouse. And some of them I'm going to continue to let grow in my basement under the grow lights. Let me go show you their new home in the greenhouse. All right, so I just brought the majority of my tomatoes out to the greenhouse where they're gonna be living until I transplant them either in the garden or to a larger pot and put them outside. Let me show you what I got. I have 10 indigo, which are sort of a heirloom, darker colored cherry tomato indeterminate cherry tomato. Then I have my golden varieties over here, gold nuggets, which are gonna be the only determinate variety that I grow this year. Um, they're also a cherry tomato. Then I have the sweetie pies, which are an indeterminate cherry tomato that I've grown for the past couple of years. Same with the Chadwick cherries another indeterminate cherry tomato. The Granaderos, I have I believe four of them. They are an indeterminate variety of plum tomatoes. And then I have this new variety of cherry tomatoes called Bomb. And they are also an indeterminate variety as well. And I put out some zucchini as well out here for the first time today. Feels really warm in the greenhouse today. And this is my first time putting anything in this greenhouse and trying to grow my seedlings out in a greenhouse. So I'm a little nervous, but I'm excited as well because we're in May. I don't really foresee a ton of cold nights coming. Um, I'm almost more worried about it getting too hot in here. So yeah, hope you guys liked the video. I wanted to share 
with you my progress on my tomatoes. And I know some of you might be saying, Lucas, what the hell are you gonna do with 50 tomato plants this year? Well, I'm gonna grow a ton of tomatoes. I'm gonna try to sell some as fruit at my farm stand in Smallwood. And I'm also gonna maybe try to sell them as plants too. So get them started, see what I could do with them. Love growing tomatoes, one of my favorite things to grow. Ooh, it's hot in here. You go outside. Love growing tomatoes, it's one of my favorite things to grow. I'm gonna be growing a lot of cucumbers this year, mushrooms as always, and see what else I can grow this year. A lot of squash. Can't wait, and I'm gonna keep you guys updated. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you wanna see what I'm doing this year. Going big. Have a great day, and stay healthy.